James, a 3-0 defeat this afternoon to Raith Rovers in the Scottish Cup to knock us out. How do you sum up that one? First and foremost, massively disappointed that we're out of the Cup. Um, I think that obviously this, the sending off changes the game. Um, I think we're in control of the game. Um, that, that, that changes the game and then from then on obviously they've scored. Uh, they have not looked at the decisions back yet. Obviously they've scored and then, you know, there's no way we should be letting that game get to 3-0. You said that the red card incident changed everything, but obviously we were still on the front foot for the next kind of 50 minutes until the penalty decision came up. The, them getting that one no, we really seemed to, to change the momentum. Yeah, it does obviously, you know, when uh, they get the one nil need, uh, lead, we have to go and uh, it's the cup we need to go and try and get something to get back into the game. Um, so we started pushing a, you know, a few players forward and you know, uh, we, we, we conceded a couple more goals, but um, no, it's obviously we're the boys are hurting in there, the management team's hurting and we know after the it wasn't good enough after the, the after the first goal went in. Uh, it's obviously clear to, to see that it's it's like the epitome of the season where yeah. we we don't seem to be taking our chances and getting punished defensively. Is it just a case of continuing to persevere and hope Morocco changes? I know well you can see I think the first sixty minutes in the game we had more of the possession, created creating more of the chances and you know as a team we need to be sticking them away. There's, you know, we can't keep, you know, saying, oh, we've had chances, chances, but we need to be put, we need to, the team needs to be putting them away, uh, and that's uh, hugely disappointing at the moment. And probably, like you said, it's the story of the season so far. It's um, probably an old question, probably not something that people are focusing on at the minute, but that allows us to focus on the league campaign first and foremost now. And uh, at the end of the day, that's that's our bread and butter. Yeah, no, it is. It's the bread and butter. It's, you know, everyone is a player. You want to have a good one in the Scottish Cup. Uh, and see what happens there, but no, now we're out. We're off to f focus on the league, and you know it's a, it's another it's a cup final game on on the, against Morton for us next weekend. It's it's a massive game, biggest game of the season, uh, and we either go one way and we we rally around and stick together and start putting these wrongs right and um, climb up that league table, or you know the season kind of like um, or we go the other way. And you know, like I said, all the lads in the management are hurting in there, and we need to we need to rally around and. And, and get the three points on Saturday. As you kind of said, they're a, a big game against Morton, so it, it sounds like despite the disappointment, there's still a, a determination to turn the things around. There has to be. There, there has to be, and there is. There is a determination, and and there has to be as well because you know we're not happy with that. We're not happy with that after after 60 minutes, and we'll be doing. We'll be working hard, doing everything we can to put that right. And just to finish up, what's your message for the Dunfermline supporters this weekend? Obviously a big crowd turned up, near enough 2,800 of them, but they'll be going home just as hot as you are. They will be, and you know all we can do as players is apologise. Fantastic backing yet again uh, from the fans. They were they were brilliant throughout. They stuck with us even though we were uh, down in the game. And Obviously, we need to give something for them to cheer about as well, and that comes from us players. We need to give one uh, performances and... and and I'll put a run together for them as well, not just for us, but for them because they've backed us all season, and that's something as a group that we're that we're going to we're going to do, and that's what we're and just looking up the league. Thanks, James. Thanks very much. Cheers.